Hey pretties, welcome back to my channel. If you don't know me, my name is Tanya and I film all kinds of pink, girly, beauty, fashion, and lifestyle videos on this channel. If that's something you're into, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and push the notification so you don't miss any of my videos. And I, thought, it's time, I'm letting you go. I don't know why I just put the camera <laughs> so low when I pointed. Anyway, look at my pajama. It is Juicy Couture. We are all full chill vibes today because for today's video, we're doing a little bathroom reset. I need to like change out the curtains, deep clean the bathroom, change out the rug, um, add a little mat, put away some stuff like tools that I've been using. So I'm going to be kind of reorganizing some things, resetting the bathroom, giving you guys a little vlog of that. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. This isn't going to be like super um, in-depth crazy video, but we're just going to kind of clean the bathroom. Let me show you guys what we're working with so the mirror is obviously really dirty i don't know if you guys can tell that needs to be cleaned um counter needs to be wiped the sink needs to be cleaned you can tell it's a little dirty my straight my curling irons there i have a straightener on the floor there and it's not really messy it's just needs to be wiped down and cleaned i got these new goodies I will show you guys. Got this Juicy Couture Shower Liner. Our liner is so yucky already. Let me show you guys. Like it's just like it's not cute. Like, yeah, it's like so yeah, it needs to just be changed. So obviously the trash needs to be taken out. That's disgusting. But um yeah, th this was $4.99 at Ross if you guys are interested in the Juicy Couture shower liner. I got this at Ross also. This is a really cute like gold and pink curtain. I usually like to change out my curtain. Um, and then put the one that's there to wash just because these things, you know, they pick up germs and stuff So you just want to be washing them. This one was super cheap I don't even remember where I got this, but I know I paid no more than five dollars for it I got it in a hurry like the day we got here so that we could shower or was it like two days? It was, it was a week we got here guys and then we have to wipe deep clean the bathtub and I feel like the rest of of the bathroom's not so bad. Like it hasn't gotten too crazy. I kind of have kept up with it, but I feel like it could use a little refresh. And then up here, um, we're not even gonna touch this. This is just my body sprays. Up here I have miscellaneous things which really need to be organized. I don't know that we will get to it in this video. So maybe the next bathroom organization, we will get to it. I do need to organize my extra skincare and things, which I think I'm going to put under my sink. And this is just going to be extra things. This is like my thing to wax my eyebrows, all my brow waxing kit things. This little box up here have face masks. So, you know, it's just, it is what it is. But I always talk too much, so I'm going to like stop talking and get to doing. Also wanted to show you guys, I hung my robes. In here these are all my fuzzy robes I'm usually cold when I get out of the shower I also hung this painting here from Hobby Lobby I just love it it's so cute and chic and then we have my Kate Spade towel my bathtub tray some bath bombs this little thing here gathers so much hair so I need to clean that as well okay let's get to cleaning I'm gonna start off by getting the trash because that's always the first thing I do is this was like just thrown down back there as I try to get my bathroom trash out of the way. Go in and clean top to bottom. So I'm gonna start with the mirror, the counters, the bathtub, and then at the end I will sweep and mop. Let me finish showing you guys the haul of stuff I got for the bathroom. Wow. So really quickly, let me set this trash aside. So of course we got the liner. We have the curtain. I got this new bathroom because the other one that I got hurt my feet. So hopefully this one won't hurt my feet. And then I found this adorable bathroom rug. It's Kate Spade. I found this at Ross. This was literally $7. Really, really cheap. It has little polka dots. And it's really big actually. So it's going to really cover the floor in this bathroom to where we'll only need one rug hopefully. We'll see. Usually I put two in here but... I do have some extra little ones that I'm washing, so we can add one of those. If we need more rug, go take out that trash and get to cleaning. I'm gonna take this to the trash chute. I'm 
this little utility tray I got from like Target Dollar Spot and I have all my pink trash bags here. So I'm just gonna take one and replace the other one. Okay, as I do this, I like to take things out of the bathroom so we can comfortably like vacuum and things in here. My little scale. So anything that's like on the floor, I'm just gonna move it out. I'm actually drinking this water, so that's why that's here, but I'm going to go ahead and take my Charlotte Tilbury moisturizer and put it away. This is my little skincare cabinet. We might go in and reorganize this, but I'm going to focus on the deep clean part first. We have some makeup wipes that are almost gone. I usually just keep these right there because they're easy to grab. I don't know, so much toothpaste. Like, I'm running out of this one, so I bought this one. Started using this one, stopped using. But this still has some, so I need to finish it up. But I'm just going to take everything off the counter so we can wipe it, pretty much. I don't think we got enough time Sort out the fights Sort out the lies Oh, baby okay for the sink and the bathtub i use this stuff called the pink stuff it just cleans everything really good it's really good for ceramic so um, I don't know if this has like an all-purpose or not sure, but this is what it says if you guys are wondering. Made for sinks, tiles, ceramic, glass, showers, you know, lots of things. It looks like this and you just take a cloth or a sponge and you basically want to coat your surface in it. I just did the same to the bathtub. I got this brush on Amazon to more easily scrub things like your bathtub. So I'm going to give the bathtub a little scrub and we're gonna rinse it all off. I'm going to also throw this on the walls. This is just dished on a uh, Dawn dish detergent, but you could really use it for anything. So I'm going to remove the products. I don't know why I didn't remove all the products out of the shower. clean this disgustingness. Ugh, I don't even know how this happens. It's gross. The more water. Literally leaves it so like, sparkly clean. And you can use a wipey to do this when it's mine's a little bit dirtier. I will, but because it's not that dirty, I'm just gonna use my hands. I don't even have my nose done right now, so it's okay. This will get rid of any more gunk that maybe needed to be cleaned off. Okay, I decided to let the bathtub soak a little longer at the bottom um because it wasn't cleaning off how i wanted so i'm just gonna go ahead and start adding all the stuff that goes on the counter back on the counter Okay, 
I like to just keep my toothbrush up here and that is the finishing touch. So what I like to do now is I will go ahead and light this candle. This is from Target. What candle is this? Let's see. Oh, this is a pink lady peony candle from Target. So I'm just going to light that so that I can get in the mood to finish cleaning and resetting and organizing this bathroom and finish cleaning that tub, girl, because I'm dreading that. So let me get the lighter. A little dark. Anyway, now that the candle is lit, this always gets me in the mood to finish cleaning when I do this. Gotta change out this curtain and we gotta get this going. Hey guys, it is sparkling clean. So happy. It's time to change out this shower curtain now. Take the liner, throw it away, and then I'm going to um, put this in the laundry so we can wash it. If you guys want to see what the liner looks like, this is what it looks like unfolded. It's a little bit um, see-through, obviously, so it's a lot more baby pink than it looked on the package, which is a good thing. For a second, I thought it would be too bright pink for this curtain, but it's actually going to be perfect. So. Let's put up the curtain and then I will show you guys. And these usually come with these little things, but I don't use them. I have like diamond ones, so I usually just throw them out to be honest. Holes or anything, they're just little holes in the fabric. Oh my gosh, that curtain is beautiful. I love it. So we're going to put this little mat in the tub. I'm just going to... There she is. And the shower is done. Now I just need to put all the products back. I've been using this pink frosted layer cake body wash. And I put her up here. I like having a few different choices for my body wash. So I also have this British Rose one from the body shop and this is one of my favorite spring scents from bath and body works this is rose water and ivy i really want to get the gingham print body wash but i haven't gone to bath and body works so we're just trying to go through some stock that i have and then i think i showed you guys before this is my shampoo and conditioner that i've been using the red can acidic bonding um line then i also love this way scalp and body scrub i use it for my scalp mainly that's a little sample size I'm trying to get through, but I will be buying the full size of that because it is so good. I also have this Nectar Bath Tree. It's like a whipped soap and I use this mainly when I take a bath, but I'm just going to go ahead and put her up here. I added my shampoo, body wash, and conditioner bottle. These are from Amazon. I will link them below if you guys would like them, but these are mainly for when guests stay over. And I have my Lancome. But a uh, face wash that I'm using and I used to put Manny's like stuff in these but um, he just uses his own bottles so I have Manny's body care things and we usually put them here or up here it just depends um, sometimes they move from here to here or here to here I don't know Manny doesn't really put his stuff back where it goes usually so you know i just start them here and if they end up up here that's okay whichever is fine by me but he has a few different a few different ones so i'm just gonna put them all back in there let me know if this is you versus your man <laughs> oh my goodness actually this is more than most men have i think most men have like one bottle for everything he versus him <laughs> Oh, and then we hung his little spongy up here too. I almost forgot to put back my little scalp scrubber. There we go. I'm pretty much working on scrubbing the toilet. I don't know if you guys want to see this part, but it's pretty glamorous with my little toilet brush. <laughs> so rub it, dub, dub, everything. It's not like a commercial. 
And I like to let this kind of sit in there because it makes the bathroom smell good and then I'll flush it. Manny got these. I'm guessing there wasn't any neutral or pink options. <laughs> So they're an eyesore in the bathroom, they don't match the decor, but that's okay. Um, we need wipies, so they serve their purpose. The toilet part is done. Our shower is so clean. Love it. Okay, these tools. So I have created a disaster of this basket and I really don't know if I want to clean it right now because it's midnight now. Scrub the floor and things. So let me just, let me, no, I'm not gonna leave them there. I'm putting it down so I can turn the camera. I don't make more work for myself. And then we will have to do a reorganizing video maybe. I found this at Ross. It's a Barbie curler. It's Chi. So cute. I need to take care of the living room. Thank you. You can't show my secrets. Why are you spraying the towel? Why are you doing that? Because I'm extra. Smell them now. <laughs> no, that's horrible. Isn't that to clean furniture? No. It's oh. Febreze. You're febrezing the towels? They're clean. I know. Now they smell good. So, yeah, he took care of the living room for us and the kitchen as well. Well, you know, this wasn't really like we kind of both. We've both been cleaning here and there. So, yeah, we need dining chairs still. I know. I know. I brought my pink Escoba broom. Broom. I didn't think of how to say it in English for a minute and we're gonna sweep this bathroom. This is from Amazon. I think it's around 30 bucks so if you guys are interested I will link it. It's actually really good. Escoba, I mean broom. So let's go ahead and sweep sweep and I have one more thing to reset this bathroom. Well two more things you'll see. <laughs> Okay, we put the rug down, took the tags in, so the rug is in place, and I have one more thing we're going to reset this bathroom with. You guys, we're switching out these handles to gold because the silver is a no for me, so I'm going to replace these really quickly, and then I'll show you guys the final reveal. I have the pink drill, let's get to taking these babies off. Okay guys, we have switched out the handles to gold and I feel like it matches so much better. So here is an overview of everything. I would turn on this light, but it turns on the fan and it's loud, so... I don't think we got enough time To sort out all the fights yeah. To sort out all the lies Oh baby, yeah oh, no. There was a part of me that knew that It's still uncovered